Okay, so the question I'm going to answer is, um, now that you've been playing music mobile for at least six months, identify three things you would do differently if you were to start a new game. So the first time I played, uh, I didn't even get to six months, so does that, does that count? Anyway, uh, I actually only lasted eight weeks the first time I played the game, but there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, the main thing is that I learned from my mistakes. So the first time I played Music Mogul was during the beta testing phase in August of 2014 before we uh, released the game to students in the program. So I ended up going bankrupt, which I'll explain a little bit more about below. Um, there's a lot I would do differently and did differently the second time I played. Um, and it was difficult to narrow it actually down to three, but here goes. So the first is play more shows at home before going on, t uh, on tour. Um, I chose my hometown as uh, Escazoni and I played one show at home and then I uh, was very eager and anxious to get out on tour and play other towns. Uh, because I didn't have any money or very very little money, you only start the game with a thousand dollars, I had to go to the bank and get money which I'll talk about a little bit later. And going on tour is more expensive than playing in my hometown um, because of the travel expenses and things like that it's the, the, the game is you know quite realistic um, compared to what you know what people would would play in real life so um, before going on tour I didn't have didn't have very many fans outside of my hometown so attendance, attendance was very low at my shows which which cut into my profit um, number two advertise um, period. Uh, I, I, I would, could say advertise more, but I didn't advertise at all, and this is something I, I should have, should have, uh, I, I definitely overlooked and shouldn't have, shouldn't have. So I advertised for shows in my hometown and when I went on tour. Um, a music, a uh, music group is, so starting a music group is not all that different than, than opening up a new business. So if I look at it this way, I just opened up a new business and I don't know how how can I expect um, everyone to know if I, about my band or about my shows if I didn't advertise? Um, advertising, you know, you, you can sometimes you can get away, away with not doing much of it if it's locally because word of mouth and social media and things like that can help. But as you you know you go outside of the local area, it can be more difficult. So advertising will increase the number of fans that attend your shows and will increase your fan base which I know is the same thing essentially but um, it'll increase the number of, of fans you have um, so that when you go back to that same location you're, you're more apt to get a to get more people like um, to your shows which ultimately is what we want right number three be more disciplined with borrowing money from the bank so as you as you uh, if you've played it you've learned that you can take out um, take out loans from the bank to try to um, grow your business. Well, I took out three loans within the first six weeks, um, and this caused me to get too far behind in my um, in my expenses. Um, so the expenses, including these three loan payments, had to be paid each week. And because I went on tour too mu too soon, I think, and didn't advertise, I wasn't making as much money as expected, and ultimately got behind. At the end of the eighth week, um, at the end of the second month, same thing, my expenses were $1,100 and I only had $750 um, left in my bank account. I went to the bank to try to get out more money. The bank um, would not lend me any more money. I don't blame them because I, I was uh, having difficulty paying back the loans that I already had. So um, I went bankrupt and Unfortunately, it was game over. Anyway, it's a good thing that uh, this is only a game. Um, but anyway, that's that's what I learned uh, from the first time I play I played Music Mobile. Thanks.